Today on the channel, I'll be reviewing my Fox Armor Guard. Stay tuned. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we'll be reviewing Elise's brand new Fox Racing R3 chest protector. Uh, before we get started though, if you could like, comment, and subscribe, it really helps out the channel. And babe, so why did we decide to make this video? Because I was looking up best reviews and there weren't that many uh, involving females. Yeah, there are pretty much no reviews involving women, were there? No. It's very and, hard to find them. Yeah, and so it made it kind of hard for her to decide what armor to buy. Mm -hmm. uh, so let's just get through it. First impressions, uh, being a woman wearing a unisex chest protector, how does it fit all over? Uh, I think it fits pretty well, me being a chesty person, you know, it definitely covers everything. Um, and also it protects my shoulders, uh, protects my ribs, uh, and it protects the torso up to about here. Down here you don't need to worry so much because if you ever impact, fall forward, uh, you'll be hitting your chest before you hit your stomach and all that, those other things. That and you also want the flexibility while you're riding. Exactly, exactly. and also it protects your back as yeah, well. Yeah, let's see your back. Yeah, it's pretty... Pretty large protection on the back and spine. Yes, and also there is a, another piece you can buy to get neck protection as well. Yeah, which is pretty crucial in case you're planning on hitting something bigger. Yeah. So it also has these little holes up front here, babe, that allow airflow. So how does it feel temperature-wise wearing it? Temperature-wise wearing it so far uh, has been pretty cool. All right, so uh, let's uh, get a follow cam on Elise and see how she rides with it on. All right, guys, we're dropping in the moonshine to get a little follow cam of Elisa's new body armor. Because she says she's going to sand it. Take the tabletop, bab. Take the tabletop one? Sure. You want to up with the other one? Okay, take whatever you want. Gap line. Nice. Woo. Nice. Okay, so we're back from our uh, ride with your new Fox chest protector. Sorry we would film this on the trail, but we ran out of the batteries again. So, first ride with it. Uh, overall, are you pleased with it? Yeah, overall, I would say I'd give it an 8 out of 10. 8 uh, out of 10? It's definitely thin, but on hotter days, I think you'd be able to do without it. Right. Like today. Did you feel that the flexibility was oh, good Oh, yeah, enough? the flexibility is there. The um, shoulder pad protection is there. So we'll, we'll put that in the pros. It's yeah. light. It's flexible. Mm -hmm. uh, getting it on and off with the hooks, is that... That's pretty simple, isn't it? Yeah, absolutely. Because this just latches on around. Mm-hmm. Uh, did you feel like it was too much protection or too little or just enough? I think just enough, right in the middle. Just right in the middle? Mm-hmm. Okay. And uh, did it feel like it constricted your movements at any time? No. No? Easy move. So what would you say are the downsides of... The downsides are probably wearing a hip pack. With this on, uh, you do feel like your hip pack slides a little more and you can't have it up as high as you need it to be, so maybe don't wear a hip pack when you're wearing this. Okay. Uh, anything else that you thought was a con? No, I think that was about it. Alright, so just a hip pack and it's a little hot are your two cons for it. So overall, you'd say it fits correctly and it fits well for a woman even though it's unisex? Yeah, this is a small medium. They also have a large and extra large, so it really just depends on your torso. Height, I guess you could say. Come on. Oh. Um, and everything. So. Okay. And uh, would you recommend this to women? Yes, I would recommend this for women and young adults. Yeah. Would you recommend it for men too? Oh, uh, yeah. I mean, if it's unisex, yeah. I would maybe say uh, more petite man, though. Maybe not maybe a larger man. A large or extra large? Yeah, large or extra large for. Probably, probably wouldn't fit someone like me, but. Right. 
But okay. So overall, you're happy with it? Eight out of 10? Yeah. All right, so there you all have it. That is the Fox Race R3. Uh, as always, if you enjoyed the video, if you could like, comment, and subscribe below, it really helps out the channel. And we're here to remind you before we leave that the fox says, Bye.